Hey everybody, welcome back to the Pearl. It's a whorehouse. It's a whorehouse. The Outback Whorehouse. The Outback. Why do you keep going with the Outback Whorehouse? Because it's something we talked about at work uh, just one day. I said, you know, it'd be a great business instead of Outback Steakhouse. It's Outback Whorehouse <laughs> where you eat steaks off a of whore's asses. <laughs> and if we're like, we're making a lot of money. But now this new girl started, and she wants to work for me, and she's like, but I'm not a whore. I'm like, what do you want me to call the Outback Sexy Bitch House? <laughs> this doesn't have quite the same ring. See what is so special about such a place, hmm. in my experience. But that's what women do yeah, to you. They make you change your fucking hopes and dreams and plans, and they Turn ruin and walk, everything. Stranger. <laughs> this affair is for white falcons only. Get a load of this god. You're telling us what to do? Nope. You... you aren't no common god. You're with all how, aren't you? Men, let's clear out. Don't... don't want to get on Hurricane's bad side, do we? Tell Kylo no, I owe him one. Mm, yeah, that's right. Get the fuck out of this whorehouse. Alright, we're gonna learn a specialization from us. After this bitch is done fighting these guys. Too good. Be off with you now, and be glad I only took from you your gold. <laughs> Fools. Ah, Isabel. The Grey Warden. And I had heard that all the Ferelden Wardens were killed or exiled from this place. Oh, don't look so surprised. I've seen many of your kind in my journeys, and there is always something odd about you. Huh. <laughs> Strong hands. Could I entice you to leave your order and sign up as one of my crewmen? I could use those strong hands at my... Helm. I assume you saw that little drama. None of these poor brutes has ever proven a match for me. They are too clumsy and predictable. I fight with quickness and wit, rather than with brute force and strength. I call myself a duelist because I honed my skills in duels with warriors I encountered. And we want to become a duelist. Yeah. <laughs> An unusual request, coming from a fearsome slayer of Darkspawn. I am flattered that you wish to learn from me, sweet thing. It will take you years of practice to achieve true mastery of the style, but I can teach you the basics. I do, however, wish to get to know my potential student better, so we shall call for a drink. And you will honor me with a game. Okay. Have you ever Monopoly? played Wicked Grace? <laughs> it is easy to oh, learn, but difficult to master. You must watch your opponent's moves as carefully as your own. Before we start, the cards must be shuffled. Shall I, or would you like to? Very well. There. That should be sufficient. Five cards each to start with. And may the cleverest player win. It looks like the deck is being kind to me today. So, basically, in order to win this game, you have to have a high enough dexterity or cunning score yeah. in order to defeat her. Since our cunning is our strongest attribute right now, we're going to continue playing the game and not try to do a dexterity call. I have a good feeling about this game. Huh. The Angel mm. of Death card. Cunning didn't the pop. The game is over. We must show our hands. Oh dear. Is that what you have? Do you need me to go through the rules again? Serpents of Deceit and Avarice are songs of temerity and mercy. Not a great hand, but I still win. <sighs> still undefeated after all these years. Will I never meet my match? Not so fast, sweet thing. I'm not sure I know you yet. Come. Another game. I'll try it one more time, and if it doesn't work. Oh, you're uh, a good sport. Another game, then. We'll have to Before come back. We start, the cards must be shuffled. Shall I, or would you like to? I'll good. shuffle the cards. Go ahead, you're then. Fucking cheating bitch. Are you done yet? Five cards each to start with. And may the cleverest player win. Ah, a wonderful card for me. No, we're not ah, doing dexterity. I'll lose when you try to 
Good cards, I take it. God damn it. Not allowing me to You certainly have quick reflexes. I'm quite impressed. And as for me cheating, well, the game does not matter. I just want So we actually won with a dexterity save somehow. Don't know how. You have proven yourself Normally you have to keep playing until the cunning thing pops up, but hey, whatever. This works too. I have enough high enough dexterity and you can do this. Come. We will need some space for this. And this is how you learn to become a duelist. Huzzah. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing shit. I think if you talk to this person... Welcome to the Pearl. I'm Sanger, the proprietor. Have a seat. Get comfortable. And tell me what you need. Every one of my people here is a skilled craftsman, and don't let anyone tell you different. You'll have to go one at a time, I'm afraid. Our rooms aren't quite big enough to share between so many. But we can discuss that in a moment. So what would you like me to show you? The men or the women? Or some of both, if you prefer. So here, you can have sex with men or women. We fuck women here on EXP Gamers. <laughs> some of both. Even though we're playing as Brock. Come again. But, so, I mean, just in so you real know. life, Brock says if you're only loving one sex, you're missing half the world's pleasures. Actually, over, over and Martel said that. Not happening. Or no, his wife said that. His paramour said that. One of those two said that. <laughs> it's been a while since I've seen season four. So we're just exploring some of the rooms in here. Moving on. Injury kit and love letter. Nice to have an extra li injury kit. Rooms. Nope. Daft. Okay. All right. Well, that's all there is to do in the whorehouse at the moment. We're gonna go to a dirty back alley. Fucking whore. Yeah. Hey, your side chick. <laughs> what? <laughs> huh? No. Don't it's, dodge the question. It I is hoping, Samsung I Health asking me, were you asleep between 12.50 a.m. and 9.20 a.m.? Why would they want to know? Nobody gives orders to my men but me. Silly. A little lesson in respect is in order. I see. Don't bother sparing these lots. Things are about to get messy. Now let's Where? see. Which one first? Oh, battle ensues. Yeah. I think you will be a little more surprised at a bowl of stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. Oh fuck, a golem. golem. Every every battle. Every battle. Oh. So one thing I wanted to mention, even though I I think one day, not for a long, long, long time, but I think one day we're gonna play Dragon Age 2. Oh yeah. Yeah. Because, I mean, I have beaten it. It's not terrible. People it's just not as good as the first one, attended. in my opinion. But one thing I wanted to mention is um, the fact that Sten is a Kanari warrior. Back that's what he district. is. When 2, even though this takes place the same timeline, same place, same time, same everything, they change the Kanari to have horns and to look different. All right. So Sten is just, like, for whatever reason, doesn't look like a Kanari at all, even though he's a Kanari. Which makes no sense. That's part of the reason why two is just kind of like they they. It's almost like a different game almost, <laughs> even though it takes place in the same fucking time period, place, setting, everything. It, they change so much about it, you know. Mm -hmm. 
How do I? Somebody leveled up, do you know that? Yeah, Sten leveled up. We're gonna give him some strength. Maybe he can equip his new. Uh... Maybe. Maybe. Let me give him this two handed shit. Uh, that's an activated. That's a passive. We're gonna give him shattering blows. Now let's see if he can. He can. He can wear some of the best armor in the game. Alright. Shiny silver armor. Fuck yes. Did we do the dirty back alley? Did we get there? Didn't really tell us. Okay. Says, still says we're at the Pearl. God damn it. No. Every time I try to get to the dirty back alley, we keep getting attacked. <laughs> well, we'll never get there like this. If I see another pigeon, I will kill it. Selling weed, yeah, yeah. Show weeds. Oh. She's like a suburban mom married to Jeffrey Dean Morgan, and he dies like he always does in TV shows, and then she gotta make ends meet for her fucking four kids or whatever, so she starts selling weed. That's, that's a seven season show right there. Jesus. <laughs> People love shows about selling drugs. What does that say about society? Yeah, between Breaking Bad and all these other. Yeah. All right, guys, we're going to save the game, and next time we're going to go to the city map again, trying to do these side Get quests. Get attacked again. Get attacked again, trying to do these fucking side quests <sighs> that we really don't even need to be doing right now, but I figured, hey, not a couple of them out of the way, so we're not doing a whole episode of nothing but side quests, you know? <laughs> yeah. So, all right, well, we will see you guys next time. <laughs>